guys, welcome to my channel. So I'm with my sister Paige here and we are going on a road trip to this one beach in our town. It's called Grand Haven and we are so excited. I've been there a long time ago, but I don't really remember much about it. It's gorgeous. Yeah, everybody loves it. It's like a known thing around here. So um, we're going there for the weekend. We're gonna have a little girls trip, road trip. So I'm so excited and I'll show you guys along or when we get there and what we're up to. So stay tuned. So we are about to eat at Kirby's, this place right here, and we came here a long time ago. This is my favorite spot. If you come to Grand Haven, go to the Kirby house, get the burger, it's really good. The creme brulee, iconic. <laughs> oh my god. So yeah, come to Kirby's. Hey guys, so we are at Kirby's, and this is what we got. We both got the same thing. What was it? A crispy chicken sandwich? And it looks really good with some chips. And ranch, gotta and have a ranch. Yes, and pickle. That's a necessity when it comes to sandwiches. So we'll let you guys know how this tastes. It's literally been about 30 seconds since I last talked to you guys, and I already ate half. This so is literally the best sandwich. It tastes kind of like Popeyes. I'm it just does. gonna say it. It's a little spicy, like almost like the spicy Popeyes. Yeah, but it's so good. Honestly, even better than Popeyes. I just, I'm just gonna throw it out there. It's better than Popeyes. So if you guys are in Grand Haven, definitely come to Kirby's and get the crispy chicken soup. Hey, you guys. <laughs> so it's a little bit later now. We just um, ate and dropped some of our stuff off in the car and stopped in one of the stores that they had there and I got this really cute top. It is literally like 3.30 and we're just going to the beach. Yeah. We planned on like being here at like noon. <laughs> we got such a late start today. But yeah, we have a view. It's so pretty. It I love so the nice. lake. If you're from Michigan, you're just a lake gal. Yes, you really are. You guys have to come to Grand Haven if you're from around Michigan or if you Chicago, don't even live in Michigan. Or like Illinois. Yeah, Chicago. You gotta do it, it's so nice. But we're headed to the beach now and I'll check you guys in once we get there. Okay, you guys, so we made it to the beach and oh, we're putting so our feet cold. in. It's so cold. It's so this is cold. not Georgia. Oh, this, we went to Savannah this summer for um, our 21st birthday and the water literally felt like bath water. It was so warm. But this is pretty cold. It could be because it's like cloudy today. But it's still the summer, so I don't really know. But uh, we have the lighthouse down here somewhere. And I don't know how to work this phone. Wonderful. And then we have the coast over here, which is so pretty. Everything's so pretty here. So we'll keep you guys updated later. So now we are in Chrissy's Candy, shopping around. This place has pretty much any candy you could ever want. <laughs> I have to find mom sour dots. Oh yeah, our mom loves sour dots and we can never find them anywhere. So if anybody knows where a good place to find sour dots are in Michigan, let us know. <laughs> hey you guys, so we oh. just... 
Oh. I thought it was a video. Uh, it's a video. Okay. We just left. Or I mean a pic. Okay. Yeah, we get it. We just left the candy store and I showed you guys how they literally have absolutely everything in that candy store. And I, of all things, pick Krabby Patties and gummy bears, which I can buy anywhere. But you know, it's fine. I love them. Let's so do a it's candy worth store it. haul. Okay, yeah, let's do a candy Got haul. Got these for my mama. She vibes on sour dots. Yes. They never have them anywhere. Never. Never. Next, Zots. If you've never tried them, you gotta try them. They, like, put them in your mouth and they just tingle away. I mean, they're great. Okay. <laughs> a vibe sounds like a vibe. A vibe. It is a vibe. It's an experience. It's it's everything to me. Golden hour after. Oh, okay, sis. Okay. So we just went to the candy it's store. It's in my car. <laughs> yeah, gotta watch where we're going here. We just went to the candy store and we're just walking around town a little bit. Uh, going into some shops and whatnot and we're gonna try to find a restaurant for dinner and we might go back to Kirby's where we ate lunch it was really good that's my favorite it really was so good but we're gonna try to find somewhere else first and if not we have Kirby's but so, should we get ice cream before dinner or dinner then ice cream is the real question these are the questions that haunt me <sighs> vacation so, vibes yeah we're for sure getting ice cream don't even doubt yourself about that but <laughs> We'll keep you guys updated where we go next. Hey you guys, so we are at Porto Bello in Grand Haven and we are eating this pizza <laughs> i don't know what is this it's called the abc pizza yeah it has artichokes buffalo chicken and maybe that's the b and the c buffalo chicken oh and um vinaigrette dressing up top i don't know man it's good it's seriously so good and the vibe here is very nice very um romantic <laughs> I guess you could say, <laughs> but it is so delicious, you guys. 10 out of 10 recommend. Okay, so we just got Kilwins ice cream. I got raspberry sorbet. It's actually very good. Um, we were gonna go, what was the other place we were gonna go? Temptations. Oh yeah, Temptations, but they closed at nine, so Kilwins was open till 10. So that's where we ended up going, but it's actually really good. And what did you get, Paige? I got uh, Traverse City Cherry. I didn't see a Georgia Peach. No, they did have it earlier. You're kidding. Or was no, I didn't see it when I went to go get it, though. Maybe they changed it to a different flavor. That's much crap. <laughs> so I settled for Traverse City Cherry. Very good, but I'm just gonna say I've had butter. Yeah, Four ninety nine, I mean, bro. Yeah. Four and mind you, this is a small one scoop. You know, like you can give me a little something there. Yeah. But five dollars. What are you gonna do? But honestly, I apologize. I feel like all of my footage is us eating food. But Paige really, eating. No, me as well. And that's just <laughs> what this trip has come down to: is us <laughs> eating, which I'm not complaining about. Dude, the pizza was. Oh, the pizza! Don't even get me started. You guys have to check out Portobello's. Seriously, ten out of ten. So we are after we eat the ice cream, we're gonna head back to our hotel. And I'll check in with you guys when we get there. Hey you guys, so it's the next morning. Um, last night we got back to our hotel and we were so tired so we just showered and went to bed. But now we are at the Frederick Meyer Gardens today and I'm so excited because it looks so pretty from the outside. I'll show you guys more um, once we get closer. But um, yeah, I'll show you the inside and then after this I think we're just gonna head back home. So we'll keep you guys posted. Okay, so this is inside the Frederick Meyer Garden, and it's beautiful. They have this really pretty chandelier here. I'll try to show you with some skylights. It's really big and pretty in here. Oh, <laughs> and they have a cafe over there, and this is the gift shop. And we're about to start the tour, so hopefully I'll be able to take some videos to show you guys more of what's inside, but this is just kind of the main lobby area.
look at how massive this horse is. For reference. Yeah, just for reference, this is... <laughs> yeah, it's huge. And apparently this was designed by Leonardo, Leonardo da Vinci. Yeah, Leonardo da Vinci, which is crazy. But this thing is literally huge. This is the farmer's market garden. It's so cute. They have like a little red barn over there. Just the epitome of farmer's market vibe. This is it. So beautiful. Here is the amphitheater, which apparently they have like concerts here, which is pretty cool. Kind of gives me Coliseum. So friend flying. All right, we're just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so this is the amphitheater. Give me a like if you want to see my singing skills, okay? Give me a like. You guys really should check it out if you're in the Grand Rapids area. I highly suggest. And um, make sure you go on a nice day because a lot of it is outside, pretty much all of it. So you're going to be walking a while, wear some good walking shoes. Yes. So yeah, they have a gift shop. They have a cafe where you can get some snacks if you guys are hungry, which is always good. And the prices weren't too bad at the cafe. They had ice cream. Yes, ice cream. Pop. They actually had like alcohol too. Like they had like bottles of wine. They had... Um, like drinks <laughs> so yeah definitely check it out um, we're leaving there now and we're on our way home so we have about a two hour car ride two hours 20 minutes so uh, we'll let you guys know when we make it back home safe 